terrifying scene in Alexandria, Virginia, after a gunman opened fire on GOP lawmakers who were practicing for a baseball game. Two tri-state politicians were caught up in it all, including Ohio Representative Brad Wenstrup. He jumped in to help a congressman who was shot. He was talking. He would answer all my questions. I was concerned about fluid loss internally. Uh, I found his entry wound but didn't find an exit wound, and that concerned me greatly. So even though we were able to stop the bleeding externally, I was concerned what was going on inside. And we want to bring you up to speed on the investigation. Five people were shot, including Representative Steve Scalise from Louisiana. The suspect is now dead. CNN's Kristen Holmes picks up our coverage from Washington, D.C. Majority Whip you Steve Scalise, one of five, through. shot this morning when a gunman opened fire on Republican congressional baseball players in Virginia. A lot of us were just ran to the dugout um, for cover, and uh, it was just pandemonium. Hitting Scalise in the hip and wounding a congressional staffer, a lobbyist, and members of the Capitol Hill police, who were there protecting the majority whip. Our lives were saved by the Capitol Hill police. Had they not been there, I think it would have been a massacre. Scalise is out of surgery and uh, remains in critical condition. Ohio Congressman Brad Westrup rushed to his side after he was shot. He was talking. He would answer all my questions. I was concerned about fluid loss internally. President Trump announcing the shooter was dead and calling for unity in Washington. We are strongest when we are unified and when we work together for the common good. Law enforcement sources identifying the gunman as 66-year-old James Hodgkinson of Belleville, Illinois. He was a volunteer for Senator Bernie Sanders' presidential campaign. His Facebook page filled with anti-Trump sentiments. We continue to actively investigate the shooter's motives, acquaintances, and whereabouts that led to today's incident. The members were prepping for the annual congressional baseball game scheduled for tomorrow. The congressmen say the game will go on. We look forward to the baseball game tomorrow and uh, continuing this great tradition. In Alexandria, Virginia, I'm Kristen Holmes.